I wonder, as a former police officer yourself, how this could ever have happened, how the police officers involved ever felt like it was the right thing to do to take this student to a separate room where there was no other adult there and strip search her. Well, it's shocking. It's absolutely appalling. And, um, I mean, I've got two daughters. The idea that my daughter would come home from uh, school and say that something like this had happened is absolutely appalling. So there's absolutely no justification. I think we need to look at the events. I think all the adults in the room involved in this have failed, have failed the child, have failed in safeguarding. And, and we need to understand why the school fa felt it necessary to call the police, why they didn't deal with it themselves. And then it seems to be quite shocking that the police officers thought it was appropriate to search somebody in, in that particular way. I mean, I won't go into the graphic details of that, but it, it's pretty appalling. And what, what should have happened? Is there protocol for a moment like this where police are called to a school in order to, to search a pupil? Well, the, the schools, the teachers have significant powers. So under the law, if you find drugs, you can take the drugs and dispose of it and flush it down the loo or something. You don't need to call the police. The police don't need to be involved. So, I mean, I don't know the details of why the police were called, but the police should have had the common sense to say, actually, we're not going to do the search. This is down to you.